in three days, Valentine's Day will be over. But this morning's guest is here to tell you that it's still all about the heart. Who is she? You'll meet her coming up next on Carolina People. Good morning. Welcome to Carolina People. This morning we're at Reflections Assisted Living Facility in Carolina Forest, across from Carolina Forest Elementary School and right behind Horry County State Bank. We're focused on the 14th Annual American Heart Ball to be held on Saturday, February 23rd at the Myrtle Beach Convention Center. And we're visiting with one of its co-chairs, Glenda McIntyre. Good Hi. morning, Glenda. Good to see you. Thank you so much for coming in a couple of days before Valentine's yeah. and obviously now less than two weeks That's from right. the Heart Ball. Are you getting a little nervous? Uh, yeah, we're, we're pretty excited. Nervous and excited. It's a new venue. We're going to be at the Sheridan yeah. Yeah. February 23rd. Right. Um, we've got a lot of good things planned for oh, that yeah. night and got good auction items. Right, good right. Food, good Tremendous band. menu. You brought the menu. I, I can't did. wait to talk about that. You also have a list of some of the amazing sponsors this year. Many of them are back and some, uh, a lot of new ones as mm -hmm. well. We do. We've had tremendous support from the community. And uh, we wanted to thank especially our presenting sponsor, the Myrtle Beach Herald. We and know those guys, our show sponsors. That's right. That? That's, That's out of right. Glenda's lips right here. Yeah. <laughs> thank you, Glenda. That's kind. Yeah. yeah. Well, we really appreciate it. And um, also have some new sponsors, McCaffrey Interest, but Market Common. The Market Common, mm -hmm. yes, absolutely. And Brandon Advertising has been a huge oh, uh, yeah. source of help this year. Brandon and doing all the print, all the mm -hmm. collateral materials, sending gorgeous uh, ads out. Oh, We've been yeah. running a lot of the ads mm -hmm. that Brandon created. And, of course, they helped with the billboards that Next mm -hmm. Media has been running. Yeah. I mean, you've got gorgeous gorgeous print stuff this year it's, it's really wonderful and, and they've really gone um, out of their way to do the Italian theme kind oh, of yeah. thing which the is the heart of Tuscany right uh -huh, yeah. heart of Tuscany is their thing and um, and, and a left wines I'm hoping right. they'll do some Italian wines yes. and um, red line power sports is one of the auction oh um, yeah Jonathan donors. Formo and his entire uh -huh. family and the crew out there year Jeez. after year Mm -hmm. Stepping up and donating the sea dew and the trailer. Mm -hmm. We brought in seven, eight, nine, ten thousand dollars or more year after year. I mean, that's one of the biggest mm -hmm. auction items. Oh, it is. It's great. And everybody loves it. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and, um, and then Dandelion is doing the flowers great. and uh, decorations. And then Artist Tree Studios is also another big Artist sponsor. Artist Tree Studios, mm -hmm. yes. They've donated. Um, it's a 1920s era grand piano, baby grand, I think, right, piano right. that they've painted a Tuscan scene oh, wow. on. So it sounds just fabulous. And I think Charlie mentioned also, Charlie Myrick, mm -hmm. the uh, senior area director for the Heart Association, mentioned they'd gotten a tuning package chipped in. Mm -hmm. So they'll be able to have, uh, when you bid on the piano as an auction item, you'll also get a tremendous tuning package worth $3,000 right. to get it tuned up uh, to tip top shape. Yeah, when you get it home, you have to, you know, after it's been moved, it has to right. be tuned to get right. it to work right. So. Yeah, you've got some other great good. sponsors as well. We I do. Um, AVX Corporation. Yes, we Castle, love AVX. Right. Castles Engineering. Century 21 Bowling. Oh, yeah, we know that group, yes, Century 21 Bowling. <laughs> Very well. <laughs> Tell us a little secret here, yeah. Uh huh, yeah, since I work for that company. Right. Um, Conway Medical Center and Grand Strand Regional Medical Center. Sure. Fowler oh, yeah. Motors and uh, Hard Rock Park has also come oh, in. Oh, great. Which is a new venue that's Absolutely. opening in April, I believe. And I think they're helping to host a special event afterwards mm -hmm. to thank some of, the, some of the other sponsors there. Yeah, we're really excited to have them involved. So yeah, I think it's going to be a great thing. And uh, Jeff Thompson Insurance great. and uh, Next Media, of course. Outdoor, and Plan sure. Plantation Federal Bank, Smith Sap, Crump, uh, Book Bookhart, Crumpler, Crumpler and Callahan. And Callahan. Yes, yeah. yes, big name there, right. WBTB 13, no, WBTW 13, sure. and then Waccamaw Cardiology. So far, those are our ma major Those are big sponsors, sponsors all with either $5,000 cash or mm -hmm. more, many of them and giving above. value in their services, mm -hmm. which you really have to have the services as well as volunteers like you and right. sponsors the, to really make it happen. And folks mm -hmm. who buy the get the reservations. Share with viewers, if a viewer needs to get off to school now or get family or get off to work, mm -hmm. what's the best number 
for someone to call. I think there's a Heartball line, isn't there? Yes, it is. If you want information on uh, sponsorship right. or reservations, it's 282-2932. Okay, 843-282-2932. And I think the Sheridan, the Convention Center Hotel, has given some tremendous rates for rooms that's, that night, Saturday right. the 23rd. Mm -hmm. I believe it's eighty nine and eighty nine dollars, yeah. and so, so even you can if, stay there afterwards. <laughs> which is a great idea yeah. for folks who are out partying and dancing. To is it jumpstart again this year? Yes, it is. To jumpstart okay. that night, they want to just cruise, uh, crash, mm -hmm. and head on upstairs, uh, stay in there for eighty nine dollars. Right. Just wrap it into the price of those reservations mm -hmm. or the tickets. It's a good deal, and um, also uh, there's there are quite a few sponsorships available for less than five thousand. Really um, good. So you can go all up from three to down to one, or, or you know, just even below that. So. And the sponsors can still really get their uh, name out and uh, mm -hmm. get some exposure, even this close to the event. A lot of folks think, well, what, what am I going to get out of it at this point? Well, A, you're going to get into the event. B, you're working to fight heart disease and stroke. Mm -hmm. And C, obviously, there's still some uh, listings in the HeartBall program book, mm -hmm. even if it's in a special section. Sometimes those special... Uh, drop-ins at the last mm -hmm. minute are seen by more people because they have to see you when they open the book up. That's true. And in addition to that, they're doing, I think, a quarterly publication that they will be able to advertise in. Yes. So it's already included in their sponsorship. In the sponsorship. So that's year-round That's promotion. a very good point. Every quarter after mm -hmm. the event, highlighting getting ready for next year's mm -hmm. Hardball, the 2009 mm -hmm. Hardball. So, Are you going to be stepping up to the plate as uh, co-chair again next year? Oh, have they already talked know. to you about that? <laughs> they mentioned that. I don't know. I'm sure they <laughs> have. Well, you know, it was fascinating. As I was looking at my notes to prepare for this morning's interview, uh -huh. I looked at this fax I'd gotten from you in February of 2004. Yeah. And on that fax, I'll read, this year I'm co-chair of the Heart Ball along with Evelyn Brandon and Beulah mm -hmm. Butler. That's Four right. years ago, you were co-chair. And, of course, this year you're with Joyce Gardner. Mm-hmm. Joyce is uh, from Grand Strand, uh, director of nursing there, and Great. she's been a huge help, as well as Grand Strand, and uh, we're excited to have their sponsorship. And, oh, yeah. And everything, so. They've really stepped up to the plate with Conway Medical Center to wrap it around, and I think mm -hmm. Georgetown Memorial Hospital Systems and Waccamaw Community Hospital, mm -hmm. again, have come in at a big $3,000 yes. level, which That's is great. Right. Yeah. Hopefully we can get all the hospitals and the medical centers involved year after year to wrap mm -hmm. around the, 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 the fight against heart disease and stroke. Is this a real fight? Is this something that viewers need to be concerned about, Glenda? Yes, I think um, the, the heart, American Heart Association set a goal in 1999 to reduce the incidence of death from heart disease and stroke by 25 percent by the year 2010. Mm -hmm. And at this point, they have already reached that goal, which no. is just tremendous. It's already two, in two 2008? Early, wow. Yeah. So, and that comes through um, funds for research and education and, and you know, community programs and, right. and everything. It's just a huge impact on society. So. And the, those research dollars, are any of those actually spent in North Carolina or, or South Carolina or North Carolina? Are they spent in the Carolinas? Yes, there's four right now, MUSC and the University of South Carolina and um, a couple of more institutions are right. receiving research funds. I saw that in one of the flyers, the Medical University of South Carolina, mm -hmm. USC, and Clemson University. That's right, Clemson. Getting some of those dollars here mm -hmm. in the Palmetto State. Yeah. From that, of course, a lot of those dollars also go to other research institutions that are doing special things all over the country to make sure you get it right. If you're going to fight heart disease and stroke, let's right. make sure that all institutions are working together for that. Mm -hmm. That's true. And this year they're doing a special appeal for children's um, cardiovascular health. And Is that a problem, Glenda? It's terrible. You know, with obesity, you know, childhood obesity, oh, childhood yeah. smoking, um, kids that smoke under 20 are at a higher risk for incidence of cardiovascular disease right, and stroke. Right. Wow. You know, so they're trying to fight that. They're um, donating funds for research on diabetes, too. So, oh, great. Um, it's, yeah. it's just across the board for kids that they, they want to do a lot more research funding for them. So if a viewer picks up the phone and calls the 282-2932 number, mm -hmm. A, they can get in, as you talked about, they can get in that a quarterly publication, but they can also right. get reservations or tickets mm -hmm. for a Saturday the 23rd for the Heart Ball, and they can still get inserted in the program book mm -hmm. and be there that night and really help fight childhood obesity and heart That's disease right. and stroke. That's great.
Yeah, and that night we're going to have some uh, special programs run about children who have had uh, heart disease, congenital heart defects, and oh. things like that. So there are 36,000 kids every year that have are born with a, a heart defect. 36,000? So. That's a terrible yeah. number. So all the, the funds for research will help help mm. those kids mm. hopefully mm. have a better life. So it's not just buying tickets or reservations uh, for, for the night. There's other ways. You can make a direct donation, I guess, or even uh, some of the auction items. Mm -hmm. Let's get into some of those auction items. Glenn, and again, the phone number, 282-2932. 30, that, yes. That's, that's the right. direct heartball mm -hmm. line, 282-2932. So folks right. want to call uh, in the evening will kick off at? At 6.30. Okay, It great. begins at 6.30 with um, orders and and drinks and, and time to preview or look at and bid on auction items, the great. silent auction items. And we have some great items. Yeah, um, let's talk about some of those. I yeah. think you've got a list of some oh, of those. Oh, we do. Um, Share with there's viewers. a promotion that went out this week, some literature in the mail uh, about this Cadillac Escalade from Fowler Motors. Yes, We're hoping I like how to you sell say that, that. <laughs> Cadillac Escalade. Yeah. Makes you want to buy one. That's great. Yeah, the starting bid's at $65,000. $65,000. Yeah. Wow, it's a lot of money. And the proceeds but, are to be donated by Fowler Motors. You can actually view the vehicle at Fowler Motors right now and place a bid by calling the Heart Association. Right up the street here on mm -hmm. Highway 501. Yeah. Great location. It is. And um, it's black. It's really beautiful, beautiful You've seen car. It. Yeah. Have you gotten in it? <laughs> no. Have you talked to Brian? Valentine's <laughs> coming up, Glenda. I'll give I him know. a call after the interview. Yeah. <laughs> no. But that's, that's a, a huge item. And... Um, and then the other one is the Sea Dune trailer yes. uh, from Redline Power Sports, Redline. and that can also be viewed there. Good, at Redline Power Sports. Mm -hmm. Again, right here on 501. That's right. We're right here at a very easy to find location here in Carolina Forest, mm -hmm. you know, across from Carolina Forest Elementary School. If folks mm -hmm. are heading out to Redline, they can even pop by here and see reflections and mm -hmm. then keep going on up to, uh, to Fowler Motors. Yeah. It's, and uh, but the the minimum bid on that is seventy five hundred. Seventy five hundred for and that night bid, at the uh, okay yeah, great. You can bid on that now also by calling that number two eight two twenty nine thirty two. That's yeah. tremendous, Glenda. And um, and we have some great live auction items. We're doing um, a six course dinner for eight by Executive Chef Tom Mullally. The personal chef Tom yeah, Mullally. Yeah, fabulous. That's have, a really you, hot yeah, item. <laughs> yes, yes. Have you? Uh, Ever had some of his food? Oh, it's wonderful. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Really, true popular. gourmet. <laughs> he really is, yes. And then uh, barbecue for 100 with uh, music, live music by Paul Grimshaw Band oh, yeah. and Beer. Um, that's donated by uh, Teddy Henry. The auctioneer. Yeah. Yes. Who's yes, going to be the uh, the MC, I think, that night at uh -huh. the Heart Ball. Yeah. I heard about that. Teddy's things have gone for consistently around almost three thousand mm -hmm. dollars annually so for what you could buy it from him for let's say ten twelve dollars fifteen dollars mm -hmm. ed folks are consistently coming knowing that those dollars are all going to heart dis fighting heart disease and That's stroke right. they're paying thirty dollars a head mm -hmm. to be able to get that of course they couldn't get the paul grimshaw ban That's unless true. they come to the hardball i think beer's also been donated uh -huh. beer is donated so it'll be a great party Giannis, absolutely <laughs> that's tremendous yeah and um and then uh, we also have a week in new york and oh, wow. the upper east side includes airfare is that right yeah so who donated that harry pavlak and oh, the uh, spirit airlines is that yeah. his place yes it wow. is so and i think of perry i've, I've heard it's wonderful really? it's a great location and and uh, really nice Harry likes to shop, so that's probably uh -huh. the place he stays when he goes shopping. That's yeah. right. <laughs> that's great. But we'll talk to him about that to thank him. You've got amazing auction items, both yeah. live and silent mm -hmm. auction items. And there's one more. Aspen Grill has recently donated a wild game dinner with wine oh, great. for eight. We're going to bid that up. It's great. <laughs> yeah. Make sure we uh, put that down. To see, yeah, wild mm -hmm. game dinner. I like yeah, that. that should be different. That's yeah. a great idea. How did we land that? Oh, I'm not sure. We had the some hacklers, good committee uh, contacts. you got a great, uh, and of course, Vicki Talbot, She's working chair. hard. She was with us a couple of weeks ago at the Bridal House of Charleston, mm -hmm. there on Main Street across from the former pavilion. And boy, mm -hmm. hearing her talk about some of the items, uh, she's a real cheerleader, Glenn. Oh, she is, and she has a wonderful committee, too. Yeah. Pat, uh, but uh, Patty Gresco and Kathleen Burroughs are helping Are they her. on the auction Shannon committee? Shannon Camp. Right. And, 
And some other, a lot of other people too. You hate to really begin naming it. names because you'll always forget stop. somebody. That's exactly <laughs> right. Yeah. I want to keep talking about all of them. And of course, you've got a real dedicated committee. Who are some of the other folks with you on the, is it, so break down for viewers just so they'll know, A, this is all volunteer driven. Mm -hmm. There's some staff, uh, mm -hmm. Debbie and Deborah and Charlie. Um, right. And of course, uh, the young gal, I can't, um, Chris, uh, her name's slipping me, Catherine, Catherine Levenis, yeah. I'm yeah. sorry, works Catherine with the Ride a thon mm -hmm. but of course mm -hmm. ultimately helps out with Deb and others uh, for the uh, for the mm -hmm. gala. But how is it broke, uh, structured, the heart ball itself? Well, we've got several big committees, and the auction committee is one large one. Right. And um, then there's decorations. And right. And uh, publicity promotion and sponsorship. Uh -huh. and sponsorship right. committee is and, huge. And then, too. so you're on all the committees, Glenda. I'm essentially kind yeah. of doing a little bit of everything. Everything, yeah. Yes. And Ray Spitz is in charge of the sponsorship Great. committee. Great. So How do you really find the time, Glenda? <laughs> you just and you mentioned <laughs> uh, penny bowling and Century Twenty One yeah. bowling. Obviously, you're a realtor yeah. and work in the uh, uh, work in the market here and, mm -hmm. and, and dedicated therein. Of course, you've got a love of uh, Fighting, uh, fighting heart disease and stroke, having mm -hmm. worked in the healthcare industry directly and indirectly right. for years. Right. Am I correct? Uh -huh. You were a nurse at some Yes, point? I was a nurse in um, a, a cardiovascular unit. And, Is that right? Yeah, and uh, my husband does um, open heart surgery at Grand Strand. He's a cardiothoracic surgeon? Mm -hmm. That's a big deal. It is. It is. Mm. So we have a lot of uh, vested interest in heart disease and prevention. Um, my father, of course, um, has had uh, quadruple bypass surgery. My mm. mother died of a stroke. So, Did she really? Um, mm. Years ago, and um, so it, I think heart disease affects every one of us, and and it just makes sense to help help fight that and fund research mm. Mm. to prevent mm. it. So all the volunteers, many of them have uh, dedicated reasons for wanting to volunteer to the Heart Association. A lot of them having experienced personal things, tragedies, the loss of parents to either heart disease or stroke or to mm -hmm. other um, physical malady. I mean, mm -hmm. just other things that have impacted them. They really want to make a difference. That's right. You can see that. Yes, I can. Mm -hmm. and, and Vicki Talbot, she, of course, she's a, a nurse and teaches right. nursing at, right. uh, at Tech. But anyway, um, got a lot of good, strong people on this committee. And yeah, I'm really yeah. thankful for that. It takes a team, a whole team, right. to put it all together. The old, it takes a village, yes, yes. yes. So right. we think about of those lines, or we think about the Clintons in that regard, and President Clinton's goals, or former President Clinton's goals of really working hard to fight childhood obesity. Mm -hmm. It's a real issue, working with others around the country and the heart disease's goals of a child, fighting childhood obesity. I mean, this is for real. Oh, it is. It, yeah. it has a huge impact on their lives. So later on, they're more apt to get heart disease earlier and mm -hmm. strokes. So. Mm. It's, you know, what you do for your children now, it will impact the whole rest of their life. Right, and right. So it's a good thing to, to uh, get that information out and promote exercise and, mm -hmm. and, uh, and discourage smoking and right. things like that. And that's a, that's a real, real problem in our area. Break down the evening for viewers. we we got about five minutes, Glenn. Yeah, I'm sorry gosh. to say time is <laughs> flying. But let's break down the evening. We want to hear about this menu. Why should folks uh, call the 282-2932 number? What are they going to experience uh, if they're in town on Saturday, February 23rd, and they can get over to the Convention Center Hotel, to the Sheridan? What are they going to experience when they walk in? Oh, it's, it's going to be a great evening. You walk into the um, Sheridan where you'll go through registration, get some appetizers and wine, and, right. and uh, being passed around. And, and uh, the appetizers are more Italian style. Right, with sure. bruschetta and, and anapasto, and then they'll have some uh, uh, fruit platters and things right. like that, and cheese. You know, getting a little back to normal. But, right, sure, sure. Um, and um, and then uh, when you go and, and and preview all the silent auction items, make your bids, and then we'll go into dinner about eight. And uh, the band Jumpstart <laughs> will start playing then. And um, the band begins playing at eight. Yes. Okay, yeah. great. We're going to wow. start the band going and get everybody in to have dinner. And During dinner? Yeah, okay, good. And they That'll start out with an appetizer of scallops over risotto, uh, yeah. and it's fabulous. And, yes, um, yes. Scallops, um, salt, and boca. 
Yeah. I'm probably not pronouncing it, of course, with your no, Italian, right, uh, no. <laughs> having visited Rome not too long ago, you could probably fill us in. That's right. It's a little taste of Italy. Uh, but we're doing a salad of hearts of romaine and tomatoes, pepperoncini, and and uh, garlic crostini on top of that. It's a really beautiful wow. salad and um, Parmesan dressing. I'm just sorry, Ronaldo and Fran can't uh, be in town for oh, the hardball. Oh, we're no. going to miss them. They would love it. Yeah. But the entree, they're doing um, a, a filet with a Chianti reduction on it, and it's fabulous, and wow. uh, salmon. Grilled salmon. Filet and salmon. Yeah. Not filet or salmon, right. but filet and salmon. Filet and wow. salmon. So That's you tremendous. Get two wonderful entrees with some rosemary roasted potatoes and, right. and asparagus. And then the dessert is really special. It's an individual tiramisu. Is that right? And it's really, they've done a fabulous job That's with tremendous. this menu. tremendous. And you've got a dessert sponsor this year, right? Or a special sweet sponsor? That was sponsor. the sweet touch. That yeah, was the sweet Fowler Motors. They're doing special little candies on the That's on, on top on of the, the dessert. Table. Wow. Yes. So it's going to be a sweet <laughs> night, yeah. Saturday the 23rd. That's but right. But it's going to be a wonderful meal. And uh, uh, I guess dinner and uh, dancing will, will last from 8 to and well, dancing will be until midnight. Right, sure. <laughs> That'll be sure. a great time, and everybody always loves, you know, looking at, at all the auction items and enjoying dinner. What is the attire for viewers who may not have attended? And again, they can travel in from all of our viewing area, from the PD, from southeastern North Carolina, folks from Laurenburg or Lumberton or Columbus and Robeson uh, in Scotland counties. Mm -hmm. I mean, this is a real opportunity to come on down, make it a, a weekend, even come yeah. in on Friday, spend a couple nights, but particularly to be there on Saturday. And what's the attire mm -hmm. if they're coming for the first time, Glenda? Well, it's black tie, and Ooh. most ladies will have um, real dressy gowns, right. long, long gowns, sometimes shorts. So. Yes, yes. So Are you all still planning a thousand people again this year, Glenda? No, we have actually tried to cut back on the numbers to make it a little more intimate affair, okay, if you consider great. 600 intimate. <laughs> 600 folks might yes. not be intimate to many. But, but it's a uh, little more uh, conducive to right. getting around and seeing all the auction items and, oh, yeah. and uh, having uh, just, just ease of seeing everything. One of the first years, uh, I mean, five years or so ago, when it was held at the uh, convention center hotel, they couldn't hold it mm -hmm. in this grand ballroom and had to have it actually in the convention center. Mm -hmm. It was way too big. Yeah. And of course, it, uh, albeit at the same time, it's, it's been a tremendous event year after year, whether mm -hmm. a thousand people or this year at mm -hmm. 600 or mm -hmm. 650. So mm -hmm. it'll be a great night. A great yeah, we're night. looking forward to it. Yeah. And, uh, and uh, there's still time to, to make your reservations and, uh, and become a sponsor too. Probably a pretty good Valentine's gift That's since right. folks still have 48 <laughs> hours to plan. You and Brian have big plans for uh, Thursday, Glenn? Uh, I'll probably be working on the hardball. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he can hear that, uh, yeah. hear, the, hear the line right now. I'll be working on mm -hmm. hardball. Well, I'm That's sorry. Right. That's, uh, he's going to be down about that, I'm sure. But at the same time, with so much happening yeah. leading up to this event and being now, mm -hmm. What, 11 days away? Yes, it'll then be here the 23rd. Soon. Wow, Glenda. Yeah. And for you right here at the tail end, when you're two weeks away, I know you're planning mm -hmm. for this year-round. Mm -hmm. Obviously, they solicited your help, you and uh, Joyce Gardner's help early on to get yeah. on board. Planning that far out, a lot has to happen. But how about in this last 10 days leading up to the event? Well, we're actually um, trying to get vol extra volunteers. You need more for, volunteers? Yeah. Great. Yes, Could they call the... The 282-2932 yes. number yes. to volunteer? Okay. Mm -hmm. We need to help the day of and the week of right. um, just getting everything ready to transport over there. Picking up auction items. Do you mm -hmm. have them all ready, all together? Um, no, we're still collecting. Okay. okay. So that's something that folks could possibly uh -huh. help with. Mm -hmm. If they've got a truck or have some, uh, some extra space in their car, mm -hmm. the 282-2932 number, mm -hmm. the same number to call for reservations or sponsorships. That's right. And sponsorships are available from $1,000 to $25,000 mm -hmm. if folks want to step up and still mm -hmm. take advantage of some of the marketing opportunities. Mm -hmm. That's right. So, um, and the other good thing about uh, the sponsorship is that, you know, the deadline for payment, I think it's June. Oh, June great. So, so folks don't so have to pay all of their up, amount yeah. right now. They can mm -hmm. spread it out over four, four mm -hmm. or five months here. That's right. So That's it makes tremendous. it a little easier to... Uh, to do absolutely some of the five thousand dollar sponsorships they could do a thousand a month mm -hmm. february march april may june i mean mm -hmm. even a little longer yeah that's right
That's tremendous. That is tremendous. Well, of course, we see some of those, the dessert party for 100 donated by the melting mm -hmm. pot, the chef's table at mm -hmm. Umi Pacifica Grilled uh, d by the Divine Dining yeah, Group. Yeah, that's another great item. That is. And that we've is. got jewelry and golf and and fishing trips and there's a, a sea do ride to watch dolphins. And, Get down, yeah. right. Anything you and Brian have your eyes on already, uh, Glenda? Not just yet. Not yet. <laughs> there's, so, yeah. there's so many great items. Yeah. We want to be able to see them all and yeah. then decide after that. Thank you again for your tremendous volunteer service again this year, Glenda, just like in 2004 and in many years around this. Uh, looking forward to a big night. Oh, we are too. And thank you. Thank you for all your help. Absolutely. Stay tuned to more Carolina People with Glenda McIntyre, the co-chair of this year's 14th Annual American Art Ball. Coming up next. Why is Glenda doing it? Why are all the volunteers doing it? Why are they making such a commitment to this year's Heart Ball or the Heart Walk or the ride a or so many of the events of the American Art Association? You heard Glenda talk about it, the loss of her mother, the quadruple bypass of her father, her husband's job, what her children are doing, and children in general. This is real. This is real. Last year, more people died from heart disease and stroke than from cancer, diabetes, accidents, and AIDS combined. Heart disease and stroke, this is a real need to get out there and, and, and live the fight to make a difference. 843-282-2932. 282-2932. Of course, it's coming up. We're 11 days away, Saturday, February 23rd. It's going to be a tremendous night. Myrtle Beach Convention Center Hotel. Get out there. Make a difference. Give them a call, 282-2932.